Hello everybody, it is NuclearX86 here and welcome to a Minecraft video. In this video, I, I am going to show you how to make a 2x2 two two flush piston door. I hope you enjoyed this Minecraft video and please like and subscribe. J j just please do it. Please. Okay, so now we're going to get into the... So what the requirements you'll need is you'll need some sticky pistons. J just get a stack of these to be perfectly safe. You'll probably want a, le a lever, some redstone dust, repeater, whatever block you want to make your door of. For this example, I'm gonna make the door quartz. And I'd possibly recommend maybe two kinds of wool. I'm just, I'm just, you might not need the two kinds, I'm just being on the safe side. You have two fists, so let's get started. So what we first want to do is place in two sticky pistons right here. It can be anywhere, this just is my world. And then on the back two sticky pistons, place two extra sticky pistons. Now this works for um, practically any Minecraft version that's got pistons and that in it. So. I'd say from at least Minecraft 1.7.10 to be, because that's the only versions I know. So you build this and you have your walkway, which will mark with light blue wool. So we know that's the area that has to be cooked clear. Then we put two more pistons here. Oh, sorry, we want to get rid of those and put these away and put these here. Now you notice how they're one block away, <coughs> one block away from here. So what we now want to do is go here, place the pistons, and now they're identical. So what we do is we get the block of our choice and put it right here in between the two piston faces. Same goes on this side. So we have this set up, it's all fine and dandy. So now we, we want to put the blocks we want it to blend in with here. We've got our walkway. And what we want to do is get some um our coloured wool and put it in this. It's kind of it's kind of like a mustachey smiley face thing. Though what we now want to do is put this here and here. Chuck the, some redstone here. Put redstone there. Put two. T click on the repeaters once, and then. We put the block we want to use to trigger the door, place it here, put the redstone there. Now we're going to put the lever here for the door. And we're going to put some redstone on top of that block. Now this is just a very temporary design though. You'll see when we flick it, all the pistons fire, the door closes, which is what we want. And then when we flick it off, Gone. Now, this is different from a normal piston door because the reason it's called a flush piston door is because it's completely with the wool. But like, I'll mark, I can mark it out with blue wool. You see, um, these are the blocks, and when it, it goes together and pushes them out, so what happens is. I'll just move the lever here so you can see. When we flip the lever, what happens is the pistons on the sides push it forward. These these guys, these pistons forward, and because it and and then of course this redstone is already activated. So these guys, once they're there, activate and push their blocks here. But because of the the delay, the the um one the delay on the repeaters, these guys have time to retract. But and then these guys pull them back the other piston so then you see smooth animation now you can't spam it or if you spam it you end up with some weird thing that happens where I think it's some just some weird thing and it ends up messing up your entire system so I wouldn't recommend doing that but then all you have to do is Put whatever method of activation you want. Then we can um, cover it up.
almost. We can cover it up. Put it, make it shut. We can change the door. In there. Two by two flash piston door. This is very simple and Oh, you, you really basically all you do need is you have you do have to have the nether though beside that you're you are you're good i find this door pretty neat though it it, it it's it's super quick and fast you, you you really can't beat it to be honest it's flat with the wall you can like you can even do this Perfectly normal. Have two-way activation even. It's it's the possibilities are, are very are basically endless. And you can, if you want to, get a redstone torch. Put that there. So now it's when you turn it on that the doors. Okay, I've, the liver's in the wrong place. Just realised that. Now it works. Ha. Now why why redstone torch? Come. On just simply using it but with the redstone torch you can actually have two-way activation so you see I can now get a circuitry uh, line of redstone leading up from here to there so now what happens is we can open it then let's pretend we've walked through and it automatically closes then we're like we want to get through still it just opens on this side now now you don't you don't need to do this this is just a little bit of extra idea that i reckon is a cool feature to add and then that's kind of like the end of the video. I, well, it, it is the end of the video. 